Hey everyone! Yan, pasok! So, we're now in Suelio Village. We're back in Suelio Village for another uh, house tour. And now we're gonna show you a nine bedroom house with um, seven bathrooms, a uh, thousand square meters of floor area, 430 square meters of lot area, and a lot of furniture. So, let's go! So, ito yung bahay. Ito yung uh, pagpasok mo ng door. Uh, Siyempre, meron tayong ulit open um, space, which is actually a chimney. Uh, so, yung likod ng TV na yan is an actual working chimney. Uh, tinapalan lang ng, ng TV kasi hindi masyadong ginagamit. So, all of the furniture, uh, before we start, no, all of the furniture in this house is already included. So, let's go here. Um, so, we have our dining area. And then this dining area goes through this uh, parang recreational area also. So okay siya for vis mga bisita or uh, syempre kapag marami kayong friends na pumunta Baguio or family, ayan, pwede kayo tumambay. Uh, Kasyang-kasya kayo dito. So we also have a parang lanay over here. This is the lanay. So it overlooks the garden. So, sa isang lote na 420 square meters, it's my garden ka pa, medyo okay na rin. So, it's overlooking that area. Um, yeah, so we have another space here for uh, visitors' uh, events. Okay, so galing na tayo sa lanay. So, we're now going into the kitchen naman. So, maraming sitting area actually, no? So, in the future, if you want to refurbish or re-renovate the area, renovate the house, uh, syempre, you can add siguro another kitchen or palakihin siya. But, you know what? Medyo malaki na rin. So, this is the kitchen over here. Um, so, the kitchen is on the south side of the house. Uh, so, we have our pantry here. Yan. So, meron tayong utility door doon. So, sa mga galing sa mga palengke, yan, diretso na yan dito. And then, uh, yeah, so we have, uh, actually, hindi siya, wala siyang window. Um, so, parang ano lang siya, parang light source lang siya. Tapos nilagyan lang ng design. But, I think that can be fixed or that can be changed also. But overall, okay rin kasi lahat ng, ano, lahat ng uh, cabinetries are 100% wood. And um, parang hindi siya plywood, sabre. Uh, it's it's really expensive now yung mga ganito, kasi when you buy that instead of yung ano lang yung plywood, laking gasos na rin siya. Pero yun, so it's it's mura before. So that's the advantages of buying houses that are quite old. Um, some of the furnitures that are now expensive. Uh, before mura pa kasi siya, so that's included in the price. So like these. Um, although, yun nga, yung mga furniture na so, ito, well, may iba kasi nakikita sa mga surplus uh, sa mga Japanese stores. I think it came with the last owner, that's why it's there. Um, but overall, okay naman. Okay naman yung pagkakalagay. So, uh, let's now go to the second floor. Second floor. Uh, so, most of the bedrooms are here. So, in this floor alone, it has four bedrooms and each has its own uh, toilet and bath. So, okay. So, this is the other room. Uh, ito yung Pinha Masters. So, it has its own balcony over here. So, this is more of the right side and in same direction as the garden over there. There are tayong closets for the clothes over there. All right. And um, we have two bedrooms over here. Yeah. So common pala. Common pala itong dalawang bedroom na ito. So ito yung CR nila. All right. And this is the other room. So basically uh, similar with the other room on the opposite side. So, actually, pag akit mo ng stairs, may open area ulit dito. Um, so, they can use this for... Um, yan, dito kasi nakaset up yung console eh. So, yan, TV, uh, Netflix, uh, 
um, uh, games, di ba? So, it's a more quiet side kasi pag nag- uh, nag uh, host ka ng party sa baba. Siyempre, yung iba gusto manood ng movie. So, that would be a good place. This would be a good place for that. Ayan. So, nakaset up rin siya. Actually, the the house is littered with all of these furniture that you can use. I'm, I bet walang laman. Ayan. So, <laughs> tama. Um, so, you can utilize that when, whenever, uh, if you want to move in the house, you can utilize for the bedrooms kung mas maraming gamit yung isang kwarto. Okay. So, this is the other bedroom naman over here. And it also has its own CR over there. And this is the balcony. Ayan. So, we have a balcony in the front of the house over here. Ayan. Alright. So, puna tayo sa third floor. So, ito na yung last floor ng house. Okay, so this is the final floor. Uh, so this third this third floor is basically an attic. So kung may sobra kayo mga bisita, yan pati kayo maglatag ng mga mattresses dyan. So we have a CR over there. And uh, this side alone, uh, it has three bedrooms naman. So each bedroom here has its own furniture na double decker. Um, so basically, I think you can have a, have an, a small Airbnb um, house. Uh, kompleto naman siya sa garden. It has its own uh, bedroom. Mar marami eh. N nine bedrooms. Imagine that. Nine bedrooms with um, eight CRs. So, you can rent it out basically. No? And this area has a very strong uh, source of water. So, hindi kayo mamamablema on that part. No? So, that's it for this house. If you want to inquire about this property, please contact us with the details below and don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel for more properties in North Luzon.